Hey guys, we're out in time for summertime. Today we have here... Big Daddy Kane. Now, can you please tell my international audience what role you played in hip-hop? Um, MC. I mean, that's really the best way to define it. MC, lyricist. All right. And how does it feel to watch hip-hop grow all the way up to its 50th birthday? And where do you see hip-hop in the, in the next five years? I think that um, it's a beautiful thing to see hip-hop stand the test of time because so many people thought it didn't and didn't really respect it as a real music genre. So, therefore, I think that this is beautiful. And the next five years, we don't even need to talk about that. We need to talk about the next 50 years because it's here to stay. All right. All right. And my final question, have you ever been the, to the continent of Africa? And if you have not, would you like to? There's been three different occasions that we were supposed to have shows in Africa, and each time they were all canceled. But I'm ready and willing to go. So whenever we can, y'all promoters, let's make it happen. All right. all right. And I actually live in Ghana, so that's why I'm asking that question, Ghana, West Africa. And I want to teach you one word in their language. Okay. So one of the predominant languages there, although they speak English a lot, is tree. And one word from there is midasi, which means thank you. Say what? Midasi. Midasi? Yes. Okay. All right. Thank you so on, much. Right, okay. Now, my question to you is, and um, in your in in your your, your Ghana style, um, the African fish fish stew. Do you put okra inside of it? Yeah, I don't know, but I'll find out. I'll find out. Okay, I'll find out. I'll just message you. <laughs>